pay attention. Creepy weirdo. I would like a strong, powerful woman to protect me. Mm-hmm. He'll fight for America. Yep. Poopy Square. The Playable Characters Podcast. Hey, everybody. Hello, coming in hot. Welcome to Playable Characters Podcast. Cast, cast, cast. You are Calvin Cato. And you are Brian McGinnis. Hey, guys. This is level 98. Oh, my God. We're two episodes away. That's pretty crazy. From level 100. Yeah, then we quit. It's going to be a big thing. <laughs> We're going to quit forever, I think. We've done enough. Uh, um, we haven't. We're just getting started. Yeah. And, uh, <laughs> For 98 weeks. We have a lot. <laughs> it took us 98 weeks to get going. We really hit our stride. This is our anti-penultimate episode, <laughs> you guys. Um, so this is uh, uh, the best podcast in the world. The funniest. Best podcast. Also, best vocabulary in the world. Anti-penultimate. Is that a real word? Anti-penultimate. It should be. It so is. that would be before. Wait, not the last episode. Not before the last episode. Uh, so before the. Before the last episode. Before, before. Yeah, the so last there's episode. ultimate. That's the last. Right. Ep- that'd be the latest episode. Penultimate is before the yes. last. Yes, and then anti-penultimate. That'd be like not really the ultimate. The, not really the last. <laughs> before the last. You could you could also just call it pen pen ultimate. Oh, our guest is good. It knows what we're talking about. Of course yes, he does. You can just double it up. Why don't you just double it up? That's because true. Because anti means before, and then the pen. There's a whole thing. Look, he looks pissed. Let's just dive in. Hold on, guy. Before we dive into our guest, uh, follow us on Twitter at Playable Podcast. Our yes. Patreon. It's patreon.com slash playable podcast. Uh, what else? Uh, Instagram, <laughs> playable yes. podcast, all that stuff. Yes. Check us out. Also, email us if you have any ideas for characters. Yeah, playable podcast at gmail.com. Yes, 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 yes. And uh, let's dive in because this guy's ready to go. Apparently. He is. Uh, well, you know, he had to leave Angel Island for us, so yeah, sure. we're very, very happy. I'm also really excited because he was actually one of the characters who I was always thrilled to play as this is in the Sonic the Hedgehog one series. Of your favorites. Oh, my God. Yes, you, love him. You can introduce him, Calvin. Please welcome Knuckles the Echidna. Hey, hey, thank you, thank you so much for bringing me here today. Thank, uh, it's good to be here. This is awesome. Yeah, yeah, I'm really thrilled to have you in the studio. This is great. He's just like punching his fist. You see that? I know. Oh, Which look, is Nux. really bloody. So that has to I be know. <laughs> <laughs> you know me, old Nux. Old Nux. <laughs> That's what they call you. Oh man, so Knuckles. Well. Are those? I, I, I gotta ask my Are those real? Is that like your hands? Like, uh, yeah, they're the real. Gloves, even without the gloves. Yeah, you got the spike. That's pretty awesome. Those yeah, are, yeah they, it, you think the spikes are in the? I glo- don't know. Yeah, I guess I can see, but they're like not the same. They're the same color as the glove. It's clearly part of the glove. Yeah, I just wasn't sure if it was like you take a glove off and boom, it's still. You still got these giant. Knuckles. But that isn't. Yeah, yeah, they're yeah. they're like that all the time. Like yeah. going knuckle deep for me is always a problem. <laughs> okay, I, I bet. <laughs> this is so great. I used to do that often, knuckles. What? Are you asking that often, Knuckles? Can I call uh, you Nux, or what do you prefer? I prefer Knuckles. We're in a professional setting. It is good to get some positive press here. Mm-hmm. Yeah, definitely. We're here to t- you know tell your story and whatever you want to talk about. This is a well, um, just after the whole Ugandan thing. What? 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 Ugandan thing? <laughs> do you guys not know about that? I no, I thought you're a big fan. I I am, but what what is this? Well, there's a whole like now. Every time you Google me, it's just Ugandan Knuckles. It's just a weird knuckle oh. character someone made. That looks like me, but like smaller and fucked up. Oh, oh yes, I know what you're talking about. Did you know that? I, I didn't know that was called Uganda Knuckles. Yeah, it's super racist. It's yeah. not great. Uh, I really hate my name being attached with it. Oh my god, I didn't know this at it's all. It's really a crisis. Yikes! This is like Pepe the Frog. This is real bad. <laughs> yeah, it's not. Look, B, B, and Four Chan, and all those. Yeah. Oh man! Wait. So what's what happened? It's someone's drawing like a racist picture of you and calling it a. No, it just looks like a really like deformed, messed up knuckles. Like it's a it's a drawing, or did you? Say uh, it's a like three D character yeah. that someone made for virtual reality rooms. Oh my god! Call it, he's like super short, <laughs> and they call him Ugandan Knuckles. Terrifying. Yeah. I gotta look that up later. Yikes. No, you should. <laughs> it's it's not great. Uh, I didn't know. But it's just that's every every interview now. It's like, oh, you know, just like, are you worried about it? Or worried? And I'm like, no, I just want to talk about. I actually, uh, I I can't, like, I can't. I just want to talk about my new uh, like uh, workout fitness program I'm oh. trying to oh, is that what you're bring doing out. Now? Sure. Yeah. What, what is it? Yeah, yeah, sure. Well, you know, look, I mean, I'm super strong. I break through walls. Gr- I yeah. can lift way over my own size. <laughs> sure. Yeah. And so I, I've been working on this workout program so you can be as strong as I am. Okay. Mm-hmm. I would need to uh, know this. This is great. Called yeah. uh, Nuck If You Buckle Down. Uh, <laughs> okay. Why not? And get fit. <laughs> yeah, that sounds good. <laughs> Nuck If You Buckle Down? Yeah. like Named it- after the rap song? Like inspired by, yeah. Okay, <laughs> just making sure. Okay, cool. 
<laughs> Great. <laughs> uh, what does the workout consist yeah, of? Yeah. Do you like punch boulders every day, or do oh, you just? Yeah. Well, first, yeah, you gotta. You, it starts off with you find a hill nearby you and you slowly climb it <laughs> uh, up. And then you glide down. You do like three or four reps of that. Yeah. Just really get the it works all this upper, and it still it works your dreadlocks that you use to glide. Yeah. Oh, nice. You, Which, still, you still have the dreadlocks. I, I, it's nice to see you. you yeah, thank you. Kept you. your look. You kept your look. It yeah. looks great on you. I mean, people really, uh, yeah, like uh, in this wave of cultural appropriation. <laughs> yeah. Uh, people were uh, hesitant to mm. let me knuckles have my dreadlocks. Right. But uh, here's the thing: I realize, what's it a kid in a culture? We don't know. Yeah, I was gonna say because I don't. I've only seen one other echidna, period. So in the uh, like in the your in your universe. Thank rather. you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because there's Sakal. I remember her. Oh. Right. And then she was the only other one I ever saw. She also had dreadlocks, but so, I could tell with yeah, dreadlocks it was just, just like she didn't wash her hair. That's what you guys do. No, it's just echidna culture. Oh, yeah. Okay. So yeah, I don't. Want, uh, so I don't want to throw any like... shade, but echidnas uh, were here before people, so maybe. Uh... Is, that, is that true? You guys are that old? I didn't know that. As a yeah. Oh, per- that's cool. I mean, you th- how old do you think people are? Compare- people came from, people like, evolved from monkeys. 2,000 years yeah. old, right? <laughs> <laughs> Brian's very religious. <laughs> no. no, no. Oh, Wait, yeah. that doesn't even make sense with religion. <laughs> right. Right. <laughs> it's like 2050. <laughs> well, first there was Jesus, and then people came. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Everything before Jesus, they don't consider people. No, well, no. I, I guess, yeah, you're, so uh, that's awesome. So you, get, you guys... So are the dreadlocks, like, okay. it's just a cultural thing. It doesn't help with aerodynamics or anything? Well, it does help you fly. Yeah, you catch better. wind under your dra- dreadlocks that you have all the way down your back, aren't they and heavy? it helps you glide. Aren't that's probably why it was high a lot, so that makes sense. <laughs> <laughs> aren't they heavy, though? Like, I'm surprised you can fly with heavy hair. Well, I mean... That's the thing. Echidnas naturally, naturally very light. Mm. That's the thing. It's like it's a weird. I'm a weird mixture of very light bones sure. but very dense right. fists. Okay. <laughs> it's such a good mix. That's weird. Yeah, yeah you think like like it's it's not quite like a bird. It's like a bird <laughs> mixed with like a heavy like an ape. Like yeah, a, that's what echidnas are. A birdie. People, yeah, people don't really understand. That's what our uh, basic like not enough to fly, but right. like enough to glide. glide yeah. Absolutely. Now you can't run as fast as Sonic. Correct, but which, which no one can. Which but is who, who, why? Like why at that point, you're you missing everything. It's better That's, to stand firmly in the ground. I yeah. made this point a few weeks ago because we had we had a Crash Bandicoot on, and we had the whole talk because he's very fast, but not as fast as Sonic. But yeah, he misses everything. But your your thing is strength and, and yeah. gliding. Yeah, yeah, gliding. Gliding's pretty cool. Have you guys I, ever glided? I before? would love. To. Sadly, I never have. I've never even gone hang gliding. Maybe you should grow dreads. Ah, uh, I mean, I oh, wish I could. With dreads. <laughs> I think you'd think they were too heavy for your head. <laughs> for, for your dainty little head, you'd be like, that's, this is too heavy. I do maybe me. like baby locks. I could do like a nice little like tiny Swiss. Like but D'Angelo I, that's Russell? Not, huh? Like D'Angelo Russell? Actually, yes. He looks awful, I think. Yeah. Cool. Wow. Well, what, but, a, what a hint. <laughs> and they look better on me, I think. Yeah. He doesn't have the face for it. Yeah. I feel like this would have to be sitcoms, 90s Calvin in a sitcom where they just flash back to. Oh, yeah. Oh, this is what I had dreads. Right. Yeah. That'll be my like, Kadeem Harrison moment. Like, yes. it'll happen, and then it, people be into it. Not Harrison. Harrison. Is right? it Harrison? No, you, you said it right. Oh, okay. I think I always thought it was Kadeem Harrison, but it's not. There's I no, thought it was Hardison. Isn't there a DNA? I think it was like Harrison without the N. Harrison? Like All right, Harrison. back to my workout yeah. program. Yeah, I'm sorry. Sorry. <laughs> sorry, <laughs> knock, knock if you buckle down. <laughs> yeah, let's knock if you buckle down and get strong. How long have you been uh, doing this workout for? And where, I mean, I've been doing it the whole time. <laughs> sure, look at yeah. you. You're jacked. Yeah. Thank yeah. you, yeah. yeah. Can uh, you find it like in GNC or stores like that? Well, you can find the supplement in GNC. Sure. Okay, what is what is that supplement? Uh, that's knock if you bulk. <laughs> <laughs> that's a good yeah, it makes sense. Yeah, because if you want to bulk up, you gotta <laughs> you gotta you use my supplement. We actually, uh, it's really the supplement's amazing. <laughs> it's great stuff. What's uh, in it? It's actually we take part of the master emerald, we shave a little bit off, mm-hmm. oh. mix that in with some powder. Uh, wow. It's a little secret. Yeah, Although, isn't blend. it dangerous? Because I feel like uh, can you eat glass like that or? Well, you can. I mean, he can clearly. Oh. Yeah, I mean, I can. I remember in Oz, they were. Uh, sp- Putting glass in the mob boss's uh, food every day, and he eventually, uh, his like stomach. But this is like magic glass. It's also crystal, not glass. That's what I meant. It was the first word that came to my mind. But uh, (laughs) yeah, it's like a diamond. So that's 
my, it's it, an emerald. It's, yeah, it's, an, it's literally an emerald. It's, emerald. it's, it's in a, the name. It's not safe for us to eat, I don't think. No, if you grind it down far enough, you mix it with some water. Yeah? As part of the powder, yeah. Hmm. Here's our problem with that, is that wouldn't you be worried about people going super randomly? Because I remembered uh, in the game, there would be times where, like, if super uh, if Metal Sonic just touched the emerald, he just got all super and tried to kill you. Wouldn't you worry about, like... Well, yeah, I mean, obviously that's a risk. But uh, I don't think... I, I, I think with the amount we're using versus the amount that is overall around, I think easily not enough to make you a super, but enough to make you feel super, oh, okay. enough to do this workout. Okay, cool. Wait, so you just... <laughs> Do you need a supplement just to even do the workout? Like, is that intense? Uh, you don't need it, okay. but uh, <laughs> it's very helpful. I, I take it every day, and yeah. I'm jacked. You are, yeah. Yeah, you are. Yeah. So, uh, you glide, but Tails yes. flies flat out. Do you ever feel any, like, weird, like, you know, wind envy in that case? Wind envy? I don't know how you guys call it. <laughs> Height envy? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I don't think I've ever truly been jealous of Tails. Yeah, I mean. Look, at, like, I mean, it's just, it's just, it's like a Frodo, Mr. Bag, uh, Frodo, <laughs> Sam, Sam. Samwise. It's a real Samwise Ganji situation. You're like, I see how he's necessary, but is it worth being? Yeah. True, true. And he can, he can't fly, like, indefinitely. Yeah, yeah true. He does get tired. He does eventually. Whereas you can just keep going. As long I can glide as, as long as there's not land under me. <laughs> <laughs> Well, that's great, actually, I guess. That's a beautiful metaphor. I like that. <laughs> Is it a metaphor? <laughs> I don't know what metaphors are. I I've punched a lot of metaphors, to be honest. <laughs> I broke through them like a rock. Is that a metaphor? <laughs> no, no, that's a simile. Simile. But, all right. Now, do all echidnas have the the fisticuffs like you do like uh, do you no. know when did you know like this is that would be special? weird if i had if they if my name was knuckles right. and everybody had the knuckles sure that, that's uh, i guess yeah like <laughs> you're not the only bald person that's so we true. don't <laughs> call you baldy <laughs> <laughs> that's a great point <laughs> if you if everybody else said hair we'd be like that's baldy that's weird. <laughs> yeah, yeah. all right fair enough so, like, when did you know, like, this is special? Like, I got something cool. Uh, uh, like, pretty much right out of the womb. I punched my way out of the womb. Oh, oh that was a poor mother. Damn. Uh, she's fine. She's uh, fine? Echid echidnas are very resilient <laughs> okay. species. Just sewed herself back up. <laughs> but I just was like, like, it was like, they were like, we're going to have to give them a C-section. I was like, I got it, folks. Yeah. Just boom, more boom. Like a, more like a K-section, right? K-knuckles. No. <laughs> Calvin didn't get it. I also didn't get it. <laughs> so let's talk about Dr. Robotnik, because he keeps Ugh. tricking you into fighting Sonic over and over again. Yeah, what's and up I, with that? Yeah, you'd think I'd get better at it, and yeah. I just don't. I Well, the thing is, I love hitting people. I was going to say, you, you just have like, rage inside of you that you just want to keep hitting? or I mean, look at Sonic. Yeah. yeah. What a punchable <laughs> smirk. <laughs> That's true. He yeah, always right. has that like face that he's like, what? And you're just like, ah, you want to hit it. Yeah. And so here's the thing is, I think. Yeah. Is that yours? Your dog? No, that, <laughs> look, that's Sorry. Sonic. I've got him locked up. I'm just... <laughs> that was like a little puppy. Um, yeah, he does have a punchable face. Yeah. It's very, so like, he does have a lot of attitude, you know? Yeah, it's like a lot of like early 90s. Nah, aren't I cool? Like, you just want to like be like, ah. Yeah. yeah, he's still keeping his like his faux badass attitude that Genesis tried to put really hard like out there but you know you but then you came in you're like wait this guy's actually really a badass that yeah was, yeah I'm Sonic. actually like I break through walls even Shadow's cooler than Sonic he's, he's, he's exactly black. he's black so naturally he's cooler I think right Just, I mean that is true that know. is how that works usually now, how about uh, also Shadow had a gun though but how'd you feel about that wait what I don't know about this yeah Shadow, yeah, Shadow got, got a gun that's, later that's a whole controversy Shadow uh, has not got a gun and people are like uh why is this animal shooting interesting <laughs> I mean I have a gun I just don't use it <laughs> for Sonic <laughs> You have a gun? Obviously, I have a gun. I have three shotguns on me right now. What are they? Why in do my... you need a shotgun on Angel Island? That's true. Why do you need a shotgun anywhere? Because it's fun. <laughs> my hands are already Second Amendment rights. <laughs> I also get guns. <laughs> wow. Uh, okay. You know what? Fair enough. I'm not going to argue with you. No, we you have guns. We... Like, it's fun to punch things, it's also fun to shoot things. Yes. Can you punch a bullet? Are your fists that? Are your knuckles that strong? I've never tried to punch a bullet. Hmm. That is something I'm gonna set up. I can like I've never tried to punch that. I mean I don't know. I'm gonna have to do some tests. I'll have to get. 
I might have to talk to Dr. Robotnik, make him think he's tricking me into mm. fighting Sonic again, if you know what I mean. Yeah. And then be like, I want to see if my bullet and my fist can test bullets. And then he'll make gloves. Maybe if they can, he'll make me gloves. That'd I can. Cool. That'd be like, great. Like Chris Angel like eats bullets or something, right? Doesn't he do something like Does that? He oh, he ca- oh, yeah. He catches bullets he catches in his, his mouth. mouth. Oh, okay. Oh. And then, then like shits out like a bird. Oh, man. What a mind freak. He's, yes. He's magic. Jesus. Oh, yikes. Um, yeah, he's actually not allowed on Angel Island. We don't allow Chris Angel on Angel Island. He keeps trying to show up. <laughs> That's say, ironic. He, about <laughs> he thought it was his island. I'm like, no, this is Angel Island. He's like, I'm Chris Angel. I'm like, yeah, like, that's not enough. Wow, damn. Yeah, he couldn't catch a fist between his teeth. Yeah. Do you let the Victoria's Secret Angels on there? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that that's sense. that's fair. They just they hang out. Yeah. <laughs> We go, sh- we go hunting together. Yeah, I mean, they are Do you give them guns? Oh, yeah. What? <laughs> of course. So, of course, so you're fighting with Victoria's Secret Angels. What are you hunting on that island? Oh, you know, uh, definitely not other Sonics. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> that's for sure. I'll tell you that. Is, uh, there, is there a hedgehog infestation on Angel Island? Or? Not anymore. No. <laughs> Shotguns really work. Yikes. <laughs> yeah, most things not faster than a bullet, turns out. <laughs> <laughs> Not even the self-proclaimed fastest thing there is, huh? Well, Sonic is faster than bullets, I think. I don't know. I've never tried to shoot shot Sonic. Oh, okay. Yeah. Just regular hedgehogs. You yeah, know. regular hedgehogs. <laughs> no, they're very slow. Gotcha, gotcha. gotcha. Yeah. <laughs> Let me tell you, I know. <laughs> <laughs> Do you punch them too? Yeah, they get close. But, you know, like, it's so much more effort. <laughs> like, it's fun to punch things, but, like, they... Like you punch one or two of them, they go splat. Yeah. Right. Actually, you did punch. I because I I always remember this, and it pissed me off. in Sonic and Knuckles, and you have to actually fight Knuckles. Yeah. Or when I have to fight you, rather. There was one time where you sucker punched Sonic in the face. Yeah, that's really fun. That was a, I was like, oh, this is yeah, real violent for a kids game. Well, that really, that's the violent part. That's the violent game. <laughs> one sucker punch. Well, because, you know, usually it's this cute ball and ball violence. you played Mortal Kombat before, haven't you? I wouldn't call that a kid's <laughs> game. <laughs> all, right, yeah. all right, true. Yeah. All right. I guess. It's not a bit of a lark. It's <laughs> violent for a children's sure, game. Sure. Although it. now, I mean, everything's violent. That's, yeah. I, I'm thriving. I'm actually, uh, I've been working uh, with my uh, team right now. It's, I'm trying to get on Super Smash Brothers. That's my deal. Yeah, do you feel jealous about that? Every character, we've had, every character we've had on lately is trying to get on Smash. Which, I know. Which makes sense. You know, it's kind of like foreshadowing Duke or something. Duke Nukem just tried to get on. Mm-hmm. We heard uh, a lot of people trying to get on. Which, which, I mean, are, are isn't Knuckles in his... You might be an assist trophy, I thought. But, which but that's you know, not like, right, uh, you are you wanna, kidding me? I'm a, I'm a, I am a playable character. What if you yeah. put me off in NBC world? You are literally a playable character. Ding, ding, ding. Oh, I said the name of the podcast. Yep. Uh, ah, you I words. think you know that's literally the first time someone's ever done this title drop. <laughs> 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 that's it. That's, that's why you bring Knuckles on. Uh, <laughs> yeah, that's true. I mean, I mean, it does. It would be cool to play as you, too. You know, because honestly, Sonic's one of my least favorite characters in Smash. He's not Sonic, great. He's yeah. not that good. <laughs> He's hard to control. He has no projectile. He projectiles himself, but it's like qu- it's hard to control. It's like yeah. I mean, the only the only thing really. Uh, by the way, it is fun. Uh, get, fun thing I've done when I uh, tried Super Smash. Uh, oh, you played Smash? Y- yeah, I played Smash. Okay. Uh, <laughs> what is this world dynamic we're building? Who knows? Uh, <laughs> but you play a Sonic. And then instead of playing the game, you just jump over the ledge a bunch of times. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> you just want to see him fall. You send him a video of it. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> You've done that? Knuckles. Yeah. Oh, lot. yeah. What? That is awesome. Let's get I break to... a lot of phones. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get into some of this bitterness that I'm feeling. Because you had your own game, Knuckles Chaotix, and sadly it didn't really take off. You never got a sequel or yeah. anything. Well, that's the bit. I mean, one game versus how many Sonics had? 25? Yeah. You know what I mean? Exactly. But why do you think, do you think Sonic sabotaged that? Or like, why do you think that your game never... I mean, look, uh, I think the problem is is that they didn't go as gritty as I wanted them to go. Really? You wanted? Yeah, I wanted full frontal nudity. (laughs) I wanted full echidna (laughs) hog out there. (laughs) Weirdly enough, that, couple bumps on it. Uh, (laughs) I call them little knucks. Looks Uh, like your knuckles, okay. (laughs) How do the uh, female echidnas feel about that? Or or males, I guess. Oh, female... Oh, I, I just, it's like you said fetal, and I oh. was very upset. <laughs> <laughs> Female. Uh, or or male, whoever you like. Yeah, to... no, I mean, you know, who knows? You know, w- dark rooms are dark rooms. Uh, <laughs> wow. That's Calvin's slogan. It is. But, you know, <laughs> it's all right, uh, business cards. <laughs> you know, if condoms are going to put ridges on there, mm. why not knuckles? Oh. Which, by the way, does not feel as comfortable as people think. I don't get it. Oh, yeah? I no. wouldn't know. Me neither. <laughs> 
I'm just saying for the purposes of this podcast. Yeah, just as a real uh, PSA. Yeah, a real a uh, PS gay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Have you thought about getting into stand up, Knuckles? Uh, yeah. Is there I, stand up I, on Angel Island? Not, you, know, you had to go to the other islands uh, <laughs> yeah. to do that. Obviously, you got to go to the cities. Uh, where... the, brick, the Brick Wall Island. I heard <laughs> of one. Right. Yeah, Angel Island, no open mics there. That's why it's heaven. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> that sounds nice. <laughs> it's actually decreed by the Emerald that no stand up can happen on. But. Uh, I tried it a couple times in the 80s, you know, before I got into the real bruising business. Sure, yeah. Sure. But it just didn't take. Uh, yeah. I was up for that role in news radio, and then Joe Rogan got it. <laughs> uh, you know. I can see the similarity there. Yeah, I can definitely see that. Yeah, yeah. they wanted a bruiser type, and yeah. I came in, and they're like, we're really looking for a human. It's the bigotry of the system. Oh, yeah, it's so yeah. bullshitty. Ugh. So do, do you have any Chaos Emeralds like that you've taken or kept on to? I mean, I, well, at I, one point, you literally punched Sonic in the face and took all of them. Yeah, I was going to yeah, say, that's I, don't pretty great. If, I don't know if like <laughs> you have to give them like, back or something, whatever. Like, do you have some that are hidden? Or, I don't know. Does it do anything if you have them? I'm just curious. <laughs> <laughs> why, do I feel, why do I feel like he's trying to steal Chaos Emeralds? I'm not. I think, hey, it might be kind of cool. What's in this water? No, no, it's just water, I promise. Okay. Yeah. Just a, <laughs> take a sip. See? You're good. You still here? Yeah, it tastes you like water. Awake? Okay, yeah, fair enough. Don't worry. Good, I, I'm having water as well. Don't worry. Well, yours I spiked. With human growth hormone. Oh, boy. Oop, I'm losing some I rings. cannot be on this podcast anymore. <laughs> <laughs> um, I was just curious. I mean, it might be kind of, you know, there's rings everywhere. Maybe someone has a few yeah. chaos emeralds. Like oh, wait. That. Actually, this came up a couple um I mean, Chaos ago. emeralds are obviously protected. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, totally. But just getting back to the rings for a second, where do you keep the rings? Where do you keep, what do you mean? Like you know, when do you pick them up? Yeah, when you collect the rings, like where do you, where do they go? Oh, just into my dreads. Oh, your the rings are just in your dreads. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Huh. When I when I fly, it's very jangly. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's nice. Did not know that. It's like a wind chime. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> Why do you? It's very calming, and then that's how I lure them into uh, false sense of whatever. Yeah, to say, and then yeah, yeah, false sense of security. Yes. I think it's so, yeah, and then I you fly right <laughs> in, and you're just like punch, boom, knuckle sandwich, literally. Yeah. All right, guys, yeah. you should start a little cafe called Knuckle Sandwich. It might, Another it might, business? Yeah, it actually, not a bad idea. Yeah, it might work. Mm-hmm. You know? Have you heard of Frankie Knuckles? No, who's Frankie Knuckles? He's a really great DJ. I thought it was like a mob, like hitman. Hey, go, go get Frankie Knuckles over here to make oh, him tell the I'm truth. I'm sure there probably is a, yeah, d- a like mafia a bunch of guys called Frankie Knuckles. Yeah. yeah. Actually, I'm pretty sure DJ Frankie Knuckles probably also doubled as a mafia person. <laughs> <laughs> but no, Frankie good stuff. I'm just saying. Oh, okay. Sorry. Not that I, all yeah. Knuckles would like each other. Sorry, could it? Yes and that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, do you know, uh, so about a year or so ago, we had Ray the Flying Squirrel on. Oh, right? that's right. Yeah. Sonic's failed partner, I guess you can call yeah. him. Do you, do, you, do you know him at all? He was a, the bright well, yellow. Well, it's funny because you were both actually in Sonic Mania together oh, yeah. recently. Oh. Oh, uh, yeah, that's right. In the reboot, yeah, uh, yeah. the remix. Yeah, also, so. Mighty the Art Rodello, who was also Knuckles Chaotix. I just, I, I try, like, I, I know you're talking. I like, you I see drunk? him around. Were you very yeah. drunk the whole time filming that game? It like, was called Mania. I was up. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it was Coke. <laughs> okay, yeah. It's hard to remember everything. Right yeah, here's the thing is you meet everyone on yeah. Coke. Uh, <laughs> you do not remember any of them. <laughs> No. It's the only time I've been flying faster than Sonic, though. I'll tell you that. <laughs> oh, there you uh, go. that Sonic, actually, hell of a drug problem. No one talks about it. Ooh. Why do you think he only smirks and does like, full smile? Oh, meth mouth? Yeah, a little bit. Oh, shit. Look at that. Sonic the meth mouth. So hedgehog. Wait, so- Sonic the meth mouth hedgehog. <laughs> <laughs> wow. We're learning so much. We really do. Too much sometimes, Damn. Some people would say. And then I have a question Sonic about Sonic won't come on here, though. We asked. Yeah, we tried. We had his agent, Dave yeah. David. What was his name? Big Dave, Dave Becky. Big no. Dave David no, no, Davis. Tell me not Dave Becky. <laughs> it was Big Dave David Davis. Was, yeah, uh, we had his yeah agent I think Dave, Big Dave ago. Davies. Yeah. Dave David Davies. Something like that. I'm glad you guys have kept in touch. <laughs> <laughs> we wrote a, a Christmas card saying thank you. Hey, oh, our, oh, yeah. This is our 98th episode. A lot of guests. You know? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. yeah. We're on. like the Conan O'Brien of podcasting. A lot yeah, of true. episodes here. I think Conan O'Brien is now the Conan O'Brien of <laughs> sure, podcasting. Sure. I don't know. I mean, that's just what I've heard. Very good no, podcast, sure, by the sure. way. It's fun. Yeah. I listen to it. So Guys, listen to the Conan O'Brien podcast. Yeah. <laughs> Stop listening to us right no, now. No, no, after this. Well, at least give us a give us a listen, give us a rating, and then go Yeah, first five stars, then yeah. give us five dollars on Patreon. Then go right. listen to Conan exactly. O'Brien. If you give us five bucks, we'll send you the link to Conan's podcast. Mm, give us twenty. I'll do it for five. 
It's okay. Yeah, bring him down. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I got 20 for that. Five seems more reasonable. To just send him the link to your favorite episode of the <laughs> yeah, podcast? All right, all, yeah. Right, why not? It's, yeah, I'm fine with it. It's fair. I don't know. I like um, to make him work for it. So, Nux, what's... Oh, um, yeah. Um, I do okay. dance also. You cut me off a lot. I'm sorry. It's okay. You're very excited. I know he's one of your favorites. I, I just I have a lot of questions. Like he's literally Chun- wearing red for me. I, I appreciated I, I, that. It's, <laughs> it's like if Chun Li was here for me. Oh man, <laughs> we gotta ask her. I know. Yeah. We had a protege on. Yeah, we did. Well, one day. One day. One day we'll get her on. I or Cammy. I heard Ken wants to come on soon. Oh. By yeah. the way, just let me know. I'm still here. You are. Oh, so <laughs> 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 well, Ken's red. So as a transition back to you. Great. Um, <laughs> love life. Now there. Is a bat named Rouge that I know that is into you. But yeah. You seem to be not as into her. What's going on a there? A bat? Yeah. Yeah, I mean, that that is a whole thing. I've, Liz, like, so part of me, not into the ATS. Seems a little too much, like, into, like, the pageantry mm. of everything. And I want someone who's going to get down and just, like, kind of brawl with me. You know, and, uh, uh, so brawl like, in bed, you mean? Like, yeah, 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 yeah. Like, just very life. rough. Sure. Rough and tumble, okay. you know, you know, spiky penis yeah. and everything. <laughs> I love that you made an in and out motion with your hand there. That was this wet bed does even very interesting. Sometimes. Yeah, <laughs> uh, but the other thing is, always want to have upside down sex. Mm. So there you go. And you know what? Like I'm gonna stand on my head. She'll fly up, be upside down. That seems great. Mm. I don't know how it would work. I guess I mean she's got a really strong. I guess would you would you? I'm very grip, strong. Would, would you would you grip onto the ceiling too, or a pole with your? Well, feet? I can claw. So it, it actually probably if we're gonna be honest, it's gonna be a sixty nine because my knuckles will go in up here. <laughs> oh, there you go. Her hanging down right. from the ceiling, okay. just perfect, just real nice. I don't have to paint the full picture. No, I think you, you guys got it. it. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Someone wants to uh, draw me that deviantart.com. <laughs> Knuckles and wait, is, is is that a play like Baton Rouge? Wow, are you fucking serious, Calvin? You never thought of that. N- I literally never have. Is it like bat apostrophe n like Baton? Oh no, no, her name is Rouge the Bat, but that probably is Baton Rouge. Baton Rouge. Yeah, wow. probably. I'm a genius. Well, so this is also back before when Al was like Alucard. <laughs> <laughs> he didn't know Alucard was Dracula backwards. Yeah. Anyway, um, this is a uh, this is so great. Yeah, okay. Brian, love, you had a question. No, uh, I'm, I'm just <laughs> basking in our greatness of the podcast. No, it's we've had a lot of like, you know, characters lately that have been like, you know, not really like name brand, but having someone like again crash and now Knuckles here, it's just awesome. It yeah. really is fun to to have you here. And sincerely, like I sincerely love Sonic the Hedgehog, so it's such a treat and a treasure to have you here. Oh, thank you. I, I well, I mean, not Sonic himself, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, you know, you specifically. Like yeah. I yeah. actually, I always. Like the other characters more than I like Sonic. I like Knuckles more. I like Tails more. Yeah, Sonic is like the Cyclops of the team. <laughs> like, <laughs> sure, you want him there, but he's mostly pretty annoying and thinks he's cooler than he is. Exactly. Are Cyclops is annoying? I don't know many. No, like no, Cyclops, Cyclops from like, X Men. Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. I thought you meant like uh, from like mythology. They're just kind of hanging around. Yeah, that's what we all know about Cyclops. Is. <laughs> they think they're cooler than they are with the their first, one eye. The first thing I went to is literally the movie Crawl. Because there's a Cyclops in the movie Crawl. Remember that? No, I remember Crawl. I just went Liam Neeson's <laughs> first movie. Wait, was that really his first yeah. movie? Wow. One of the first. Crawl? He's like a nobody in it. But yeah, and, Damn. And, uh, what's his name? Uh, whatever. Okay. Uh, yeah. Uh, no, I'm talking about Cyclops from the X-Men. Of course. And right I now, do. you're looking at Wolverine. Yeah. yeah. I was literally. And Cyclops is, you know, wears a blue suit, much like Sonic. Oh, there's a lot of parallels to draw. Yeah. So who's Tails? Is Tails like the Jean Grey? Uh, no, no, Tails is Storm because he's constantly being shot out of the sky. <laughs> <laughs> Every time he tries to fly, just a missile hits him and yeah. he goes down. Yeah. yeah, Damn. That always happened to Storm. It was really bad. What's up? Is, is yeah. T- Tails seems a little nice. Was he kind of just like dragged into this whole life? I think he didn't want it. but he I, it. I think there's other. I think Tails wants other tail. And that, by that, I mean Sonic. Uh, that could be it. Ooh, that's uncomfortable. Tails is like underage. Yeah, I know Still? it is. Tell me about it. Still? Yeah. I mean, he yeah. pl- well, now now it's more like, you know, in porn sometimes when they play underage. Uh, <laughs> okay. Is there a lot of porn in Angel Island? I No, it's, uh, it's, it's a pretty, I mean, they're like, there's not a lot of Wi-Fi on Angel Island. <laughs> <laughs> Must be nice. Just a nice, peaceful. Yeah. Dis- let's go there and disconnect. You know. Also, oh. we got all these Victoria's Secret angels. Yeah. Oh right. <laughs> Come on, Kel, you don't need porn there. 
You still do? Man, yeah, I still, yeah, I still do. Uh, <laughs> uh, you want to play a quick game of this? Yes. Yeah, Before absolutely. Guys, let's play a quick game of, uh, with Knuckles of Wed Bed Dead, everybody. Uh, if you don't know this game, which you probably do after 98 episodes, everybody, we're going to give you three video game characters, Knuckles. Tell us who you want to wed, who you want to bed, okay, and who you want dead. Sound good? Great. You so know the dead part. Yeah. Sonic. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't think he's on this list here. <laughs> So his first one, okay. Um, I think I know what Calvin's gonna do right away, but he's uh, from Devil May Cry, Virgil. Ooh. So he is a vampire. Okay. Yeah, half demon. Okay. Half is, demon, half vampire. Is Dante a vampire? Or they're all just demons? no, they're demons. Just straight up. Demons. I feel like this is well, no, Dante's half demon, half human. Virgil's half demon, half human. Okay. They're gotcha. so he's brothers. a demon. He's a demon. Okay, not a vampire. Okay. He's got a blue trench coat. We're not doing the one drop rule with demons, okay? <laughs> a long what? blue uh, one drop rule. Okay, never mind. Coat. I don't know the one that's, drop rule. Okay, that's just gonna be for our black listeners. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I, I don't know either. Oh, no. one oh, drop rule oh, is so like I get it now. Yeah, there you go. You can put it, it together. What is it? Um, so basically, that was a whole thing. Like back when Sight is more racist, uh, slightly more racist. Um, if you had, had were any part black, you were just considered black. So like even if you're like a quarter black, they'd be like you're black. That's the oh, white drop rule. That's cool. <laughs> no, why not? Cool. Yeah, I get it. Um. Ah. <laughs> wow. <laughs> right, Brian. You don't have enough hair <laughs> to be cool. To say cool to the one drop rule. <laughs> Damn it! I I, I miss out on so many things. <laughs> the way I was born. Um. <laughs> all right. So Virgil. Let's get back to Virgil. He's got white hair. He's got a sword. Yes. Which yes he he yeah. Dante's got guns and sword, I guess. Yeah, too, guns right? and a sword. Virgil has uh, a sword. Is he evil? Yes. Is he the nemesis of the... Uh, yes. He is, the main yeah. guy. Okay. So, badass. But white. he's got a nice long coat. You he know? does. It's, it's actually a pretty cool looking coat, to be honest. Yeah, it's beautiful. Um, badass, bad guy. Got it. Yeah. yeah. This next one... You got it. Similar in a way, but he, you know, um, his game recently... Was rebooted and came out again. Chris Redfield oh. from Resident Evil. People are flipping out over Resident Evil too. I know. Yeah. I not me. Too scary for me. Too scary <laughs> for me too. I know, actually, see? but I One might thing be. We I was a uh, friend of the show, Cherie Smith. Uh, I was with her yesterday. She downloaded Resident Evil too. It looks gorgeous as fuck. Yeah, people. It looks people. And uh, they got rid of the shitty tank control, so you can actually like run properly. Yeah. As opposed to like, let me turn slowly and yeah. then fucking press up. Fucking terrible. I miss Miriam, our ghost we had on. Oh, the, yeah. The Resident Evil house cleaner. Oh. Um, so anyway, Chris, he's um army guy, army trained. Right. All right. So like an army guy who fights zombies? Yeah. Yes. All right. Kills zombies. He's a good Fucking guy, right? Fucking hella build. He is. Yeah, he's, he's pretty Sorry, jacked, I got a little actually. moist. Yeah. Um, yeah. Um, and this one, for Mortal Kombat, um, I don't even know how to like explain her, but she's... Um, let me find a good picture here real quick. Hold on. Devora. Oh. Nah. Devora. So she is an insect lady. Yeah. She has a bunch of like wasps. Yeah, they're disgusting. I guess you call them wasps. Well, not really disgusting. Not from her point of view. Right, but you're you're not a bug person, you know? So but she's got a hood on, she's bald, she's completely yeah. hairless. Yeah. And she, yeah, she does this too. She got like she sprouts other appendages in like yes. fucking bug legs. She also like has grubs that she throws at you and she feeds them from her mouth like an insect, you know. Gross. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Good body, but it's it's disgusting. I will, I'll, I'll say. <laughs> Good body. You know what I mean? Ah, uh, thank so generous. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, thank God you did that. <laughs> but you know, like uh, I'm I'm just trying to set the stage for these next characters for this game. Yeah. Here, so. Uh, Knuckles, Virgil, Chris Redfield, Devorah, Wed Bed Dead. Yes. All right. Uh, so I think mm-hmm. let's go. Uh, I'm a wed Chris Redfield. Interesting. Strong, good, gonna tumble. You guys can probably box together. Maybe, yeah, that's right? what I'm thinking. Yeah, yeah. yeah, box together. Spar. Punching zombies seems fun. Yeah. Oh yeah, you probably punch a hole. They go flying. Yeah. Just oh yeah. Right through the knuck- knuckle, right through the head. Yeah. 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 Seems great. Yes. Very into it as like a communal activity. Sure. Plus, Chris has guns, so he does oh, have guns. You yeah, bring, you bring yours. We, we like guns together. Uh, <laughs> and then I'm gonna kill the demon, Virgil. Aww. Yeah, I'm gonna kill a demon. Yeah, because just not, you know, like I get it, but also, <laughs> <laughs> what part do you get? Uh, yeah. <laughs> 
It's a great coat. Uh, <laughs> it's coat. I get it. But also, if, it, it's fun fun to kill a demon. Have you ever killed a demon? No. Only in games. Yeah. It is fun, though, sometimes. It's real fun. Kill a demon? Way. Calvin has killed his inner demons, though, lately, right? Some, yeah, some of, some of them. Some of them, yeah. yeah. <laughs> wow. <laughs> that voice got very hot. <laughs> As it sound like it. <laughs> Calvin, stop eating bonbons after midnight. That's a that's like one of your demons. Oh my god, I actually yeah. did quit eating donuts for a bit. It there felt good. Go. Yeah, I, I used to buy like those Entenmann donuts a lot. No, it's just you know they're unhealthy as shit. Entenmann's all butter French crumb cake is my jam. Oh, that's my weakness. I'm all. I don't. I don't eat any of that. All protein. Yeah, look, look at you. You're, yeah, you're all just. Yeah. Well, you're eating like Master Emerald shaving. So like, yeah, Master Emerald shaving's an echidna meat or, and uh, no oh, hedgehog meat. Yeah, hedgehog like, meat. Whoa. Hedgehog meat. <laughs> Very of, different. Yeah. Okay. All right, so you're deading Virgil. Uh, and so, uh, bad Devora, Because, mm. one, a couple extra limbs gets you into some fun stuff. <sighs> but she's... It's oh, just, true. It's, it's like a bug, though. I can't get past that. It's like... Does it smell like a bug? Probably. Yeah. What a bug smell like? Oh, that's a good point. <laughs> <laughs> but she's like... In the game, she does like such filthy things, like the gloves. yeah, she does. <laughs> it's really the throwing up on people thing. I'm yeah, not that's into, I'm not into that. that so much. Well, that's like an attack move. Yeah, like yeah. you don't you don't look at someone vomiting on someone and go, "Man, I hope she doesn't do that in bed." You're like, "Oh, of course she doesn't." Maybe. Well, depending there's on some what you're videos. Into. I'm sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, interesting. Yeah, you can get pretty deep on the internet. Mm-mm. You I, can. I would not. Well, not. And I could get pretty deep on Devora. All right, guys. High <laughs> Nux. High, high Nux high all around. <laughs> oh, that, that just hurt. I know. Ouch. Seriously. That is a hard yeah. ass hand Damn. you have there. Yeah. Oh, the, oh wow. yeah. <laughs> wow. That's impressive. Um, Brian, what about you? Okay. I'll go. <sighs> you need some really good points, Knuckles. Um, man, I don't know. Like, it might be. Oh, jeez. <laughs> I don't know, man. Like, okay, so if I, I'll bed Devora. I'm glad you're making that sacrifice. No, you know what? No, no hold on. <laughs> I'm going to bed Chris Redfield here. All right. Uh, yeah. yeah. You know? Chris Get a little rough and tumble in there. I mean, he kind of looks like, <laughs> I'm not going to say it because you'll forget it. Um, <laughs> well, no, <laughs> just say it. Yeah, yeah, yeah say no, it. No, he's like a big, muscly dude, and it'd be like, if my first time, well, I guess, <laughs> actually, probably my 50th in this podcast. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um. Might just, you know, kind of looks like a John Cena in a way. It's okay. Just, so you're of, into John Cena. Got that weird, no, I'm not. That's why I didn't want to say it. <laughs> but it just pops into my head. It's okay if you're into John I'm Cena. I'm not. But right, I, it's a safe space. It's okay. Uh, he's, he's, got, he's got that gorilla butt. You've seen that Amy Schumer movie <laughs> when he was naked? He looks like a fucking hairless ape. He is so jacked, that dude. Um, so I'll bet Chris Redfield. <laughs> Did you see that tr- tr- train wreck? No, I haven't seen train wreck. Was I it train wreck? Yeah. Yeah. This podcast. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we're still on track here. So, with these next choices here, all right, Bed and Chris Redfield. Oh boy, I'm going to have to dead. I'm going to dead Devora. Wow. Yeah. yeah, you can't even sleep with her. She's so gross. <laughs> <laughs> it's not even. But wed, wed. You're around all the time. Bugs everywhere, Every, all day. I hate it, you know, I think she does a fatality where. She, does she put bugs inside yeah, you? Yeah, she like vomits oh, bugs oh, in your oh, I don't, Who needs that? Gut and then they bust out. Yeah, I don't need that. When she gets mad at me one night, I don't need that. Waking up to bugs like growing inside of me. As opposed well, to a demon with a all. sword. But that's, the, that's, that's why I'm just like, it's a, you know, yeah. it wasn't. So I'm going to wed Virgil here just because, again, he's got some, he's got some powers. Mm-hmm. You know, I like the magic stuff. I know. Um, you like the magic stuff. He's good. got that cool ass coat. <laughs> I think that really sold it. That did it for me today. It's a cool coat. Um, Great fashion sense. You guys can go shopping together. Right? I, I need some better fashion mm-hmm. sense. And then it can incinerate the cashier so you guys can just walk out for free. Yeah. Boom. Into Great it. idea, Knuckles. Yeah. I'm, a, I'm here. I'm an ideas man. Thank you. I so love the shoplifting chick. Those are my <laughs> Calvin's all into it now. Those are my uh, amazing choices. So uh, go for it. This is actually fairly easy. Mm. Uh, I would wed Chris Redfield. Mm. Because, uh, again, you know, he's a provider. I don't like the guns part, but he's a provider, and he's in the Army, which means he's got a sick-ass pension. And so, man, <laughs> That's a good point. when we get out of there and he's on zombie killing, we could just, like, you know, go down to, like, you know, just retire in, like, Orlando or something. No, not Orlando. Or if he go- dies, probably great life insurance. Oh, my God, the best. <laughs> I'd be like. Zombies are a tough lie to work. Yeah. yeah. I mean, I'll cry, and I'll wear black for a bit, and then I'll move into a penthouse on the Upper East Side. There and I'll you be go. like, look. There you go. I was, I'm the widowed Mr. Redfield. It'll be great. Oh, thank you. Yeah. 
Uh, Thank but, him yeah. for your service. Calvin Redfield, pretty good name. Oh, yeah. I yeah, it sounds good, right? That's not bad. Rolls off the tongue. Mm. <laughs> anyway, wow. <laughs> and actually, I'm kind of thinking about it. I like it. Anyway, Wet Chris, Bed Virgil. I think it'd be some wild half demon sex. It'd be kind of nice, you know. He could get his like devil trigger on, you know. Right. Now, um, Dante, these the, these demon devil guys are um, in your community. What would they be labeled? Because they all do kind of. They are a little effeminate. Most of them. Well, right? okay, so is like, there, is there a term for that? Yeah, well, sort of. Glampire so like, or something. I don't know. What I'm just <laughs> glampire. Why not? <laughs> it makes sense. No. I have to leave. Thank <laughs> you. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I guess so. Well, they're kind of like pretty hair. Like, there's a term in like Japan called like bishonen, mm-hmm. where it's like kind of like white haired pretty boy is what it means. There you go. But they're not like necessarily gay, but they kind of look a little fey. <laughs> so, like, I guess if Virgil would be like kind of bishonen type. Sure. Um, which, you know, I mean, I'm not really into that. Like, I like, you know, I like more like burly truckery, but like. That's why we do this podcast for so long, but I know, seriously. These arms, just, girl. Just waiting damn. for the day. Mm. <laughs> mm. Do you guys see me to leave you alone? <laughs> okay. No, leave the knuckles in play. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Knuckle song. <laughs> anyway, yeah, yeah. No, but I would bet Virgil. I think it'd be a good hot time. Mm. Devorah, here's the thing. I already don't like bugs. Right. But the problem isn't that. The problem is she's a bug. I don't really know how she gives birth, so I don't know where the whole situation is going to be like. I think it's probably in a similar place. <laughs> But it is doesn't it? have to be. <laughs> that could also be exciting. <laughs> I got a little bit of hide and seek, you know. Maybe <laughs> I like to know where the holes are. Like I don't like putting. You know, I don't want surprises. Mm. Can we get a soundbite of that, please? <laughs> I need to know where the holes are, says Calvin. My goodness, you need to know. <laughs> All right. Holes need to be in the regular place. I mean, yeah, I yeah. agree. In the most, in, in that's the a cool thing about being knuckles. You can put holes almost anywhere. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so you so you're deading her also. I am. I'm very sorry. What did you do? Not, uh, I bet you better. Yeah, yeah. You're, he takes a chance here. Yeah, I like it. I, re- I respect that. Yeah, I don't need demon seed. <laughs> <laughs> She's a very interesting choice. So, um, Knuckles, thank you so much. Yeah, seriously. Thank oh, you, thank, thank you, you for having me. It's been great, man. Tell uh, you know, if anybody else from the Angel Island wants to come on, tell them. Yeah, I'll let them know. Time, I'll talk to know. the Victoria's yeah. Secret girls. Yeah, yeah, definitely, definitely let them, let them know. Yeah. For sure. Uh, it's been a lot of fun. Thanks again so much. Calvin, would you like to say anything to you, one of your... Uh, Seriously, you're... I'm so proud of you. You've, like, done so much for, like, both yourself and the video game community. And Thanks. Kid, and, and as soon as I find out how who you are, I'm proud of you, too. <laughs> <laughs> and with that, thank you, everybody, for listening to Playable Characters Podcast. We'll see you, you next, next week. week. That was a weird ender. See ya. Bye. Today's playable character is portrayed by David Piccolomini. You can check out his live free comedy show, Ambush the Pizza Shop, at Two Boots Williamsburg in Brooklyn, New York. Or you can listen to his wildly successful online dating podcast, Tinder Tales, where he talks to comedians and actors about online dates going awry.